gonna eat pizza today okay uh, I didn't plan this so I wasn't planning on eating an 11 pound pizza today it's a team challenge but I'm gonna try to do it myself uh, you get 45 minutes to eat it it's at Rockstar Pizza in Brownsburg Indiana uh, it's close to Indianapolis Indiana uh, it's 30 inch pizza 11 pounds like I said uh, two toppings of my choice I probably pick sausage and, and black olives uh, other than that I think you get a free t-shirt uh, your name on the wall and free meal if if you beat it if you don't you owe them some money like 50 bucks and also if you beat it you get two $25 gift cards so I don't know what I'm gonna do with the gift card so if somebody is walking in can get the gift cards probably I'll just uh, surprise them It'll be a secret Santa in October secret secret Snoopy yes like Charlie Brown secret Snoopy they don't have those unless you're a detective they call you Snoopy it's a secret okay forget it I'm just going off on a tangent on my uh, ADHD side so uh, let's get in here and see what this thing looks like Hey guys, as I stated before, this is um, Rockstar Pizza. It is in Brownsburg, Indiana, near Indianapolis. Um, I just walked into here, and I, I didn't know it was 11 pounds uh, until I got here, but it was a team challenge, so I know it was a big pizza. Uh, this is a 30-inch pizza, and as you see, I have the olives and sausage on here, the Italian sausage. Uh I have to play probably music the whole way through here, so you're not going to hear any of the challenge because the uh, uh, music had all copyrighted material in it. Uh, if you look on the table, I have my Darren Eats uh, GoPro, I call it. Uh, it's a bargain GoPro. Um, I got it for like $60 at the time. Uh, this was filmed in October of 2018 so October 4th 2018 I did this uh, this is a throwback since the epidemic's going on and I haven't done any challenge this is just another throwback for right now so I hope you like the video I'm gonna throw some um, newer music in here that I get from uh, epidemic sounds um, and uh, just get started so hope you enjoy the video <laughs>
Okay, I'm about a fifth of the way through this, and you see the gentleman over here on my right and on your left? Uh, he's not bothering me at all. I know a lot of people say, hey, why don't you he leave you alone while you're eating? I don't have a problem. I, I mean, I'm not trying to set a world's record here. I'm just eating a pizza, and I like to, to uh, just be informative while I'm doing it so people don't just wonder what the heck's going on. Uh, and I ask them to subscribe to the channel or uh, just take a business card to just talk it up. You know, I, I don't try to, uh, I don't try to just be in my own zone unless it's like a really, really, really hot challenge or something. Um, yeah, but, but stuff like this, I don't mind just talking to everybody that's there. Uh, but I, I am getting through this pretty good. The pizza does taste really good, guys. Um, if you're near this area, uh, check them out. Uh, it's been almost two years since I've been there, but, uh, if I ever go back through that way, if they let me do the challenge again, I would uh, I'll probably try another topping um, just because you guys are sick of me eating black olives and Italian sauces on every single pizza. That's pretty much why I change it up. I was in Florida in Orlando and I changed it up one time because they did have artichokes there. So I was like, you know what, I'm going to do something different for the disposal team and get a different topping. That topping sucked. I'm not... I don't know if it was that artichokes at that place. At uh, I'm not going to name the name of the place, but uh, the artichokes in that oven did not taste good when it came out. It it didn't. So that's why I usually just stick to what I really like to eat when I'm doing it, um, and that's why I do it. Like you wouldn't want to get a pizza with different toppings that you normally don't eat because you have to eat 11 pounds of it. So you you might want to like it a little bit. I'm getting through this. I'm talking to the gentleman still, um, and just trying to inform him on what's going on, and and I'm all and answer all the questions I can. So. Okay, almost halfway done with this pizza, and I'm just drinking the um, water out the pitcher. They did give me a Coke or Dr. Pepper, one of the two, at this uh, establishment. Um, but I don't go with the diet. I'm not sure. I still say it. I don't know why you eat a 10,000-calorie uh, 10, pizza and ask for a Diet Coke. It doesn't make any sense to me unless you really just like Diet Coke or Diet Dr. Pepper or whatever. Um I didn't um, drink too much of that. I wait till the probably the last quarter of a pizza to change the flavor up with the sodas. Uh, I try to drink water as much as possible. Um, I 
didn't dunk anything as of right now, and I'm and I'm thinking on this video I didn't dunk at all. Um, I was trying to clean my act up here. Uh, when I first started, I dunked everything, all the crust, um, not everything, but all the crust, uh, just because I I trying to do it a little bit quicker. It was going to save me just 30 seconds on the whole pizza. I'm not going to worry about doing it. I only dunk now when it's a contest or if it's a time limit where I have to do it and I might not be able to. So um, down about eight minutes, and that gentleman that was talking to me earlier was leaving, so he gave me a fist bump there. And I think there was a table to the left of me that was talking to me and in the front. So I just I was just gabbing it up all throughout the whole event. I wasn't trying to just uh, set a world record, like I said. I'm just having a good time while I'm eating free pizza.
Hey, as you saw, I sped that up there. Um, I usually don't do them on videos. And I know for the ones that want to see the whole video, I apologize in advance, but this is just kind of boring if it didn't have the actual uh, what was going on at the time. I like the background of the chitter chatter and everything, everybody talking, but this one I couldn't at all, so I sped it up. For the people that like me fast forwarding it like that, uh, it's a once. Not a once in a lifetime, but you're not going to see that very, very much. So you're welcome in advance there. Um, I'm still chatting it up here with them, but I'm going to play probably one more song and about be to be done with this. I have uh, about seven or eight slices left, uh, and I know I probably have this. Um, I'm still feeling pretty good at this point. Um, I, b before this video, uh, before I even went in, 11 pounds, I was not even ready for 11-pound pizza. So uh, some days I just feel uh, better than others. Uh, before this, I probably had some kind of ice cream or not a solid challenge because I felt, I felt pretty good um, go, um, at about halfway through. You could tell if it's going to be a struggle or not. And at this point, um, I was doing pretty good. And I wasn't drinking a lot of fluids to get it down. All right, about to finish it up here. I didn't hit the clock yet because I did um, stop chewing. With, I didn't clear my mouth with the food. Uh, but I did finish this in 23.44. Uh, they wanted a picture of me with the platter because they never saw somebody finish this pizza alone. Um, usually two people don't finish it, but, but I was the first one to do it, so they wanted a picture of that. Um, I did uh, tell Jeff Esper about this, and he actually came in and done it solo as well after me. So if you want to check his video out, Go to his channel and check that out. If you haven't subscribed to him, please do. So thanks for watching the video, guys. Appreciate it. Till the next time. Hey, guys. I have hoodies in. The name brand are independent, so you know they are thick and high quality. I am have them all the way from small to 3X, uh, only in black right now. So just go ahead and look in descriptions for that. Uh, I do have uh, T-shirts as well. The name brand of the T-shirts are canvas. Uh, they are thick. They are soft. The logo wipes off like a bib, just like on the hoodie. So if you want those, please check in descriptions. Uh, they all are pre-washed material, so they won't shrink on you. So check in descriptions for the price and the uh, shipping and handling of that, because I do ship in US and in Canada. If you haven't already, um, hit follow on The Garbage Disposal on Facebook and follow me there to get more pictures and stuff. Uh, please subscribe to my page. Hit the notification bell to get notified of upcoming videos. And hit the like button if you like it. Other than that, please share it with your friends, family, and even your boss. Have a great day unless you made other plans.